Thank you, Mr. President, Mr. High Representative. The EU-China summit happened last week, and that's probably the only good news. Members of this House are still sanctioned for speaking out the truth about the evident human rights violations. However, it's essential to talk, open up difficult questions, and stand firm in defending our stances. Russian aggression on Ukraine is a medium to test our challenging and in many ways problematic relations with China. Supporting Russia or any form of assistance to the aggression should have clear economic and political consequences. Having said that, we cannot let this decision overshadow a long list of open disputes we have with China. As we work on energy independence, we should at the same time work on our industry redeployment and industrial independence. Moreover, we have to finally end the selling of forced labor products on our market. We can discuss with China the global challenges and negotiate the rules on how we trade with goods, but we should never trade with our values. Thank you. Thank you very much. Um,